I'm Charlie Nardozzi, and this is the Connecticut Garden Journal. Sometimes the simplest vegetables are the best. Snap beans are one of the easiest vegetables to grow and most rewarding. Many of us first grew beans in biology class in elementary school in cups sitting on a windowsill. The seeds are large, the plants reliable, and the fruits are tasty. While snap beans are easy to grow and delicious, there's one group that's even more satisfying. I love growing French filet beans. These varieties have been bred to grow slender, long beans that don't get stringy and tough even when mature. Of course, the key is to keep picking them when they're young, about four inches long, when they have the best flavor. These are fresh eating beans and don't can and freeze well. Steamed, sauteed in butter and topped with lemon and Parmesan cheese, or simply eaten raw, French filet beans melt in your mouth. Some varieties I've grown include Nickel, Maxi Bell, and Taverna. Velour is a purple-colored French filet bean, and French Gold is a pole bean version. Grow beans on raised beds in well-drained soil. Go light on adding compost and fertilizer. Beans are legumes and can fix atmospheric nitrogen into a form of fertilizer they can use. Grow lettuce and other greens around the beans to take advantage of this fertilizer production. Wait until the soil has warmed to plant, about the time you'd plant tomatoes. Bush beans mature quickly and also fade quickly, so plant in short rows in succession every two weeks into early August. This way, you'll have a constant supply of fresh beans to eat. Next week on the Connecticut Garden Journal, I'll be talking about asparagus. Until then, I'll be seeing you in the garden.